Hey, this vlog is gonna be a little bit different. It's just me because it's my birthday. So, birthday, birthday, I'm birthday. My birthday, my birthday, my birthday, my birthday. Yo, it's my birthday! Yes. Scooter gang! Happy birthday to the homies! <laughs> Scooter gang! this restaurant called Kubo for my birthday. It's um, Cuban food. We ordered these bowls. They're so good. Oh my gosh. Oh, what are you getting? Black beans. A little avocado in there. Oh. Though. I'm at the lake. I get to go out on a lunch date with a friend. Oh, and I get to go to their chocolate shop. is amazing <laughs> what are you saying to me oh my gosh you're incredible whatever <laughs> something works <laughs> oh yes i can't wait to buy some things but i just have to make sure it's like a smart Packable purchase. Okay. You know, I can't, or snackable. <laughs> <laughs> right here. Hold on. You're not done yet. Okay, oh goodness. Oh my God. It's just so bright. Hello. Hi, Cecile. Me too. I went to my friend's chocolate shop and I was able to pick up a few things because it's my birthday and I want to support my friend. So let me show you some of the stuff I got. Oh my gosh, the chakra chocolates, are you kidding me? It comes with a explanation of what's in each chocolate as well as a chocolate meditation done by Ayo. I already ate one of them. I had the orange one. Oh, so good. I think I'll have one right now. Hmm. I think I'm gonna go for the heart song. 
that's gonna be for obviously the heart chakra. It has hawthorn, nettle, hemp seed, mulberry, rose, spiru spirulina, apricot, and stevia leaf. Oh, that's gonna be a sweet one. The color is green that goes with the heart chakra. I know about nettles for the heart chakra, but I'm excited. And hawthorn, yes. Mmm. Girl, you did that. It comes in this super cute box. See how <laughs> some are missing. <laughs> I got this chocolate as well. It is organic chocolate, almonds, organic coconut, palm sugar, coconut butter, and vanilla. Mm, everything that she makes is vegan as well, so it's nice. I picked up this lotion made by a woman of color, uh, local. You buy the bottle and then you can just refill it, which awesome. This, I think, is one of my favorite things that I picked up. I was looking for things that were easy to pack because I'm on my way out and I wanted to have a little bit of, um, you know, Portland vibe, some art, and so I got this and on the back, it says, I am fearless, and I didn't know that until after I got it, so it's pretty really cool. I was blessed with these beautiful flowers from my friends JJ and Dana. I love them. This is Celosa. It's called Brain Celosa. If you look, it's all ridged like a part of a brain, very fleshy. This is also Celosa. It is, what is this, Feather Celosa. I really like it. See, I have some dried right here actually because I love it so much that I grew last year. The friend who got me those flowers, he also, Wanted to make sure I got this little guy. This is <laughs> Michelangelo, the Ninja Turtle, with the hair of a Manchichi treasure troll, which, if you know me at all, you understand that this is like now a family heirloom. So thank you. My bestie got me this ring. It's a moonstone. She wanted to make sure to get me something that was packable as well. Look at how pretty it is. Mm. And my baby brought me home these beautiful flowers. Oh, they smell so fresh. Tobias also got me a bunch of clothes. I'll try them on for you. I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you like la 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 la. Now that I'm a licensed mm -hmm. funeral director, I can wear this bag. Oh, it's JJ. <laughs> <laughs> JJ. Photo bomb, 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 bomb. <laughs> He's the littlest baby. Oh my God. One last thing that I want to show you is a project that is near and dear to my heart. It's going to be finishing up here in November because that's when I'm out. So that's when it's got to be finished. and. So yeah, check out what we've done so far. So I'm not a construction worker or anything, but I am a permaculture designer. And this is one of the projects that I've designed with my coworker, Linnea. We uh, took a permaculture design course together and then were able to successfully get a grant and a location to, um, I don't know, to show and share and build our design. So check it out. One of the things that's super great about this project is it's for our um, marginalized community or one of our marginalized communities. It's uh, a transitional housing complex. So they take recently houseless folks and give them a roof. And so we thought, hey, how about a garden too? It's a 72 unit apartment complex and this is the back area. It started out just being a big gravel and concrete slab. We've built this 12 by 12 shelter and 
we added some pear trees. And right now we're building these two beds. They are 12 by four by two and a half. So they are ADA accessible, ADA accessible, excuse me. And then these ones we're going to be lifting up. There's one here. It's a sob. Like a boss. So our goal is to create gardens and naturescapes using regenerative agriculture as well as providing um, a safe and educational space for those who are most marginalized, which would be our Black and Indigenous brothers and sisters and siblings, as well as the um, homeless and just the poor, you know, so yeah it's it's rad so yeah my birthday was a blast i hope that y'all enjoyed watching it and we'll see you in the next one Bye.